two. And day two is a really important day because we're going to paint. And painting makes such a difference in the camper because you can really transform that place from dull brown beige to a light and bright color. So I know some of you guys are overwhelmed because you have never painted before. I can show you how. There's a couple of tricks. So as you can see, I haven't done any masking tape or anything on my camber because it takes a lot of time. But I want to show you how to paint without masking tape. You take your angled brush and you dip the, cor the top of your brush into the paint. And then you lay it into your corner and slowly move your brush over to the left. Very slow and easy. You see that? And you can go over again. And it comes out really straight. Do you see? You don't need to, you don't have any mess or anything. It comes out straight if you do it slow. Slow and easy. A little bit more paint. You see that? Not that much, just the tip. And go into the corner. And then you just pull the brush over. So, and this is what you have to do with all the corners. The corners going down here, the corners on this side. And this is important so you can use the roller afterwards. You take the brush for all the edges, all the corners around here, everywhere where you can't reach um, the wall with the, with the roller. After you've done all of these, you take your foam roller. It's a small size because the wall isn't big. You roll your roller in the paint. Easy, no pressure. Just roll it. You bring your roll up here and without pressure you paint that wall. And you paint it in one direction. Don't go this and this and this. You go from up to down. And you see now here you won't touch the ceiling because you have already done all the, the edges with your brush. So that's why it's going to be very easy for you to paint if you do all the corners with your angled brush before. So again, you bring your roller into your paint, you roll it, so, so the whole roll is covered with paint. You bring it up and you go up down, up, down, turn it around when you cut to the to a corner, to a wall, and easy, no pressure. You bring the paint onto the wall. So don't stop in between a wall because it dries and then it might look a little weird if you start the next day uh, finishing up the wall. You want to see some streaks. So you just do this, what I told you, and you can do it. The important thing really is the brush that you do this easy and concentrated. Then you don't need masking tape. You don't, you're not going to have a lot of mess because it is so much preparation already done. And then the rolling of the wall goes very fast. So please. Practice a little bit with the brush so you have this easy swing out and um, it won't be a problem, I promise you. So I'm going to finish this area now and I'll see you later.